Hello there and welcome or welcome back for more Tactical Breach Wizard. I'm happy you're here. Pull up a seat, uh, relax while you're here, and let's carry on with the scene more of some Tactical Breach Wizard. And as you can see, the characters are rocking a little bit of a new fit. Well, except so I don't have enough. Well, actually, I think I do. Hold on. I don't know if it'll take me to that screen. Oh, yes, it does. It is excellent. Let's. Which one do I want for her? Funeral sheet. I like frontier. Frontier medic. I remembered yesterday when I was looking through it. Frontier medic was the one that I wanted. And I just realized her bag is like dripping with blood, which is kind of crazy. Yeah, and this guy's got the dark arse equipped and then we got desert detach actually i can get another one for her jungle tracker or was uh, i think i was saving up for one of these i really like the white witch but i'm waiting until we get to like the snow biomes so i think out of these ones i probably want to get the private eye first can <laughs> you tell that like black but yeah so that's the outfits we already did the upgrades and let's just carry on with more tactical breach i'm honestly i'm really enjoying this game the story i'm kind of i don't know why but in games i kind of just get <laughs> you know i kind of just lose interest in the story very quickly and just end up just wanting to play for the gameplay but we're gonna still focus on the story because some of you guys do you know want to see the story and stuff all right if you're taking the chopper to Kulan, they'll be leaving from the southwest slave with the helipad all right so here's what we're gonna do from this episode on because i did say that in the last episode but i wasn't really doing it i won't re i won't really be reading uh so everyone can just read for themselves i won't really be reading out the texts out loud i'll be reading it as well in my head and everyone can just read the text as they come along and you know i react now and then to funny one-liners and whatnot yeah they just threw him out a window and just for, like not for god but they just didn't kill him No, I don't think we actually, yeah, no, we did kill his henchmen. Did we? Because I could have sworn, like, the ones we didn't throw out of windows, especially the ones that he shot, <laughs> were definitely dead as hell. But the ones she, because she doesn't have any lethal attacks, so yeah, we can say the ones that she took down got knocked out because you just throw them against walls, but he definitely killed them. Toothless all around. Oh, well, yeah, that's fair. It's nothing can make a lake as you can just teleport there. See, now wasn't that better than me <laughs> trying to do a terrible job of reading? For now. Mm. <laughs> cranial interventions <laughs> I mean that's more than you were probably expecting okay knock out all enemies use laptop to open so the laptop is an objective don't let anyone sound the alarm uh, have the team use five different abilities on one turn and finish by the end of turn one okay uh how do i want to play this so she comes through knocks these three out uh, let's start with her coming through then her breaching hey what's up guys chain bolt 
Oh, why doesn't that kill him? I'm not sure. But, but, but. I don't know. Oh, it's because he's armored, I think. Probably. Uh, who cares? And uh, let me see. He can come over here. She comes over here. I'm thinking if she can put the death door behind him, use the uh, sedative cocktail to kind of daze him. There we go, shift him back one. And then he can use the three bolts to. I don't think the three bolt shifts. Oh, no, it does, never mind. <laughs> So he get get his ass out of there, and then she comes over here. I don't know if this is if he's he's not gonna reach. Can he reach her with the time boost? Oh, he can. Excellent. So she comes over here, grabs this intel. Is she not able to use the what? I can't, okay, you know what? Forget that for now. Oh, it's because I'm still on him. That's why I'm stupid. Uh, she can use the laptop now, but instead of that, uh, she can't grab this intel. Ooh, hold on. No, no, no. Okay, rewind, rewind. Get her off that spot. Because I need her to grab this intel. She doesn't have any more attacks, does she? She has transference. He still has false profits. Uh, no. So I can use her to... The time boost, get extra attack. And then if she grabs this intel, gets the chain bolt, but... Up and then to a dead, and she can now move over here and then use this laptop. Excellent, that's, uh, that's what the objective's done. Ah, starting out on a great note, Gus confidence as well. And I don't think I've mentioned this yet, but the, we get confidence from achieving the sub-objectives. So that's how I'm able to afford the outfits and stuff. <laughs> Blind optimism. <laughs> it is illegal, they're trying to kill us. Oh, that's an interesting lay. Ah, oh, I seen. I'm starting to really wish. Oh, they got windows. I don't know why I'm so excited about that. But I'm, I'm really starting to wish I'd selected for her to get two death doors instead of one. Um, what do I want to do here? Can I have her come over here? Use chain bolts. But. Wait. Cancel. Can she use it like. But. 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 Oh. How is he not taking damage? Let me see this. I oh, got shifted one to the side. Hmm. <laughs> Am I okay with that? Wait, how far can she move? She can move over... There. Okay. Okay, okay, that's fine, that's fine, that's fine. Chain bolt, but... But... 
because it kind of just feels useless to use against him because it doesn't deal any damage to him actually wait 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 cancel but 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 there we go oh okay at least that was the one damage to him and then i want him no i want her over here can she cast that door oh, she can excellent and he can give her time boost so she gets another round oh, she the thing is i keep forget oh wait no i didn't forget i'm so smart <laughs> this was a completely planned i can grab this until i get extra mana and then he gets a knockback he gets a knockback he gets a knockback and them three should be taken care of <laughs> get your ass out of here uh, wait, I didn't even look at the objectives. Chill or reinforcement doors. Uh, I've still got. Oh, there's two reinforcement doors. Knockout all enemies. A single teammate perform three actions in one turn. And. Finish by the end of turn four. Cause six total extra knockback by making enemies unsteady. Oh, six extra knockbacks. I mean, uh, hmm. Okay, let's start again. Okay, so this time we're pretty much gonna stick to the same formula, but this time I'm gonna. Wait, can she start with Death Door in the back? Put Death Door over here. Use the sedative like this. And then come with her ability, chain bolts, like, uh, bup, bup, bup. Just out of here. Does that count? Yes, three, three knockbacks. And then. Uh, let a single teammate attack three times. I can get that done, of course. And then I don't think it's gonna work, but I I can give her the time boost and shift. I want to shift him, but mm, I feel like he's not really gonna take damage because there's nothing to knock him into. So, oh, wait, 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 go back. So right here, what I should have done is used Static Blast to knock his ass back. Giving me move and then used him to give her time boost. So she can now use the three chain bolts like so. Wait, how do I do it? So I want to do one, two, uh, and then I can't knock him. So, what's the best way to do this? One, knock his ass out. No, no, no. Do it the way we did it the first time, which would be one and two, then three there we go now he's dead regardless and what's what's so da, 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 da. okay single team have performed three actions so she's done two actions i needed to perform an extra action uh since she can move I guess I can get her to move over here now, but then how does that help? <laughs> I don't actually know. So he can move over here. And then because I'm trying to see which which way would he be aiming? He's not going to be aiming. Okay, go back. 
he moves over here because I want him to aim his predictive bolts uh, right at this door and then she oh okay we can do this so she stands over here and then she uses transference on her against him and actually you know what just to achieve the before she uses transfers just to achieve the three in one turn thing let me throw a gale grenade right here giving her extra uh wait no gale grenade gives her extra move not extra attack dang it Hmm. Okay, well, I can't do that then. There's no way for me to... Let a single teammate perform three actions in one turn. I can probably do it with Zen, but not with her. But that's fine. I don't need to be so focused on that right now. So, transference on her. And she probably should take cover. Oh, frick. Are you kidding me? He's gonna shoot him before, yeah. Before he gets affected by the poison, which is very annoying. But that's fine. I can just take him off of predictive bolts and then just kill him. Hmm. If she takes cover, who is she aiming at next? Uh, no way, actually this works out. So yeah, you use predictive bolts over here like originally planned. And then you leave cover, use transference on her against him. It still works because he's going to do the full damage and he's, he's still going to take damage. There we go. Yeah, that works. And, and turn ass out of here oh freak okay you that was unnecessary you're doing too much uh if i move over how far can she move why can he move so you move over here and just seal the door and she moves over If she moves over here, right, and uses static blast, it's not gonna do damage. It's gonna is it gonna do damage to him? No. Okay. <clears throat> so before she moves over there from here, actually before any of you move over there, you get back here too. She should probably use her Spectral skull. Can I get both of them? I can. Kind of. Yeah, I can. And that kills both of them. Well, that kills him and damages him for one. Which kind of does. I don't know if that helps me. For example. God dang. Okay, well that that definitely helps. Okay, so he he did. If I use stack blast on him, knock him against the wall, does that it does do damage to him? Okay, 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 okay. We're seeing a plan. So she used the sedative on him. She can come over here. Use static blast on him. Ouch. <laughs> that looked like it hurts. And then how far can she move? Um she doesn't have transference anymore, so I probably don't wanna 
rely on that. But if she can move over here, that's fine. He, no, get your ass back there. He can move over here as previously planned. Seal this door. She moves. Uh, she can just shift a little bit. Okay, first off, god dang it. Before doing any of that, I should have uh, picked up this intel for her so she has the ability. Okay, and then seal this door, which gives him one mana, which is really good. Come over here and. <clears throat> have him because he's gonna die regardless right i need him out of the way how do i kill him this turn if i use time boost for her oh well he doesn't have a line of sight on her dang that's a shame Okay, before she moves then, uh, I can... Use time boost on her. Ah, uh, hold on. Yeah, that works. Use time boost on her. Now she can move over here. Right. Now if she moves over here, uses chain bolts. Ah, uh, he still doesn't take damage. Which is a shame. She doesn't have any attacks. I mean, he still has an attack, but it's not really going to do much to him. Yeah. Okay, I, I just realized if I did this right with her. Attacked. And then. Before she goes anywhere, have him go over here. To see how this door, giving him extra mana, time boost. Gives it to her. Now she can use Broom Breach to get over here. And use her chain bolts on him. Uh, I was hoping that would give me a different angle to knock him into, but it doesn't. Okay, that's. Uh, I don't like that. <laughs> Okay, before using Broom Breach, then she can use the Girl Grenade on him, giving him extra movements. So now he can come over here and take cover, and he won't die from him. Oh, actually, no, nah, that wouldn't work. Because if I, if I, hold on. Instead of moving over there, right? How far can he move? This far? Uh, uh, nah, I can't. I, I was gonna say if I use predictive bolt, but I can't. Pre I forgot I can't predictive bolts onto where someone already is. That doesn't really shift him. So just take over now. She uses broom breach. Gets over here and go oh. <laughs> can she move oh thank goodness she can move i was gonna say yeah she's completely exposed to him yeah so she uses boom breeze chamber but but shifts him uh 
and yeah so i think that's fine full we'll see action oh i thought she died i was gonna say oh you would not end that there's no shot you die okay and turn turn three oh i need to seal this door now another heavy is coming out i can't uh, I'm gonna get that done. Let a single teammate perform three actions at one turn. Is that possible? So first things first, she comes over here, seals this door. And then... She can't reach him. How much damage is this gonna do? It, I'm curious. If she uses static bolts on an ally, oh, that still works. <laughs> she can still move. That's interesting. I'm not gonna do that, but that's good to know. You know, sometimes you gotta make some sacrifices. Okay, that's fine. So she's sealed that door. He's over here. He can take cover. He's still gonna take one damage, but that's fine she hey if she comes over here she can spectral skull can kill him right excellent and then we're done that's what i'm talking about ah huh. oh godspeed be a f uh be a finishing in x turn something something <laughs> Yeah, I didn't get this one, which is fine. You know, we can I can always go back for that if I really want it. Uh, when I full see reaching room. Something division just kinda stopped. Oh, it's one of these guys. Oh, he wasn't there last time when we first ran into them, was he? <laughs> calories or salaries I should say mm, neutralizer you say uh, first things first I should breach here Neutralizer gets me. And then breach here. Are you serious? <laughs> okay, you, I can just put him in front like this. But you know what? Instead of that, rewind. Just do this. Put Force Prophet right in front of his face. <laughs> there we go. Just get rid of him right now. There we go. That solves all our problems. That door right. Let me get this angle right. Right. What? Right there. And where do I want to move with her over here? Static blast. Is that giving me extra movement over here to seal this door first of all i need to start reading these five enforcements in total finished by the end of turn one transfer four damage at once um i'm not gonna be able to transfer four damage if i finish by the end of turn one but can she make it to that door she cannot but he can Wait, can he just kill this neutralizer guy, please? Oh, he needs to move first. He can move over here. And um, a little... Oh, and then the clone reacts. Oh, he's neutralized. He doesn't have a reaction. Oh, that's cool. And he doesn't have... No, that's fine. Uh, she can just give him 
uh, throw girl grenade at his feet, give him extra movement, you can make it to the door, seal that, and then, okay, maybe, <laughs> eh, you know what, it's cool, I, I wanna see if this will work, spectral skull, dang it, I was gonna see if I could have an angle on him, nah, I can't, okay, maybe, <laughs> Having him there might not be the best idea. So start out with the spectral score before shifting him. Just out. The, the spectral score just takes care of him regardless. Yeah, there was no there was no opportunity for me to even take full damage at once. And then he can go over here, see the door, and we are done. Full C action. Oh, this is nice and clean. This is a tidy little room. Question about the celery guy. This is the limp arm guy. That's a good question. Someone was carrying them away from this beloved celery. I mean, I'm kind of down to write a book about Limp Arm Guy, or AKA Celery Guy. Breach, I guess. Hmm. Seal all reinforcement doors. There is four reinforcement doors. My goodness. And prevent nine reinforcements in total. Defenestrate two hostiles in one turn. Excellent. It has been well. I did earlier, but it has it has been a while since I defenestrated someone. Uh, breach. See, the issue is, yeah, that that's the issue. I can move over here. How far can he make it? Over here. But then, if I want to attack with her, would he get in the way? He would. Dang it. Okay. He can just throw out false profit right here. And then that frees me up to use chain bolts to say. Okay, that's not gonna do damage to him, but I kinda just need the enforcer out the way and this guy out the way. Oh, he said defenestrate two hostiles in one turn. In one turn. Hmm, hold on. Let me see if I can replay that better. So, if I static blast him. And that gives me extra movement. But I can't come over here. Actually, can I? Wait, is this guy standing next to a window? He's not actually standing next to a window. So before... <clears throat> actually, hold on. Rewind. I want him closer to there. And then... Before shifting him... I want to use him to... Push him back. Now he's standing next to a window. And do, 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 do. how do I want to do this? Chain bolts. So I need to use the static blast. <laughs> Knocking my window. Don't do that. 
Actually, you know what? It just says to finish straight to and um two enemies, right? So static blast them, retaliate. Oh, God dang it! Uh, rewind. He's preventing. Cause if I static blast him, right, he can retaliate. I think it's cause he's standing right in front. Okay, start again. What if I bring her to stand over here? And then false prefer of if oh I don't know that wouldn't work because false prefer would be behind her so he wouldn't focus on it oh <laughs> okay that works oh because he wasn't focusing on fo I need to keep remembering whenever false prefer first comes out he gets a retaliating shot as soon as he comes out. But he wasn't able to get it off because he was focusing him when I put him up front. So I probably want to shift his focus at first. And then get Jen out of the way so that he can be the focus. If it didn't kill him. But okay, so that works. And then... What do I want to do? I mean, I can probably just... Use him to shift him back one. Don't shift him again, please. No! God dang it! Um... Okay, I don't know. Uh, prevent nine hostiles and defenestrate... Because they're not the only two that's here, so I don't have to focus so hard on them. I can just do this, okay? It's fine. I can just static blast him backwards. Up. And then, yep, he's dead. And then she can make it over here, actually, to seal this door. And he can. Not okay, he can come over here actually. Pick up this intel and use time boost on her so she can knock his ass out the window. And ah, oh, she can't use the move speed again. That would have been so good. And then she could seal this door. Okay, I think that's all. I've exhausted what they can do from right here, to be fair. And as for him. I guess he can. I can use a go grenade. Ooh, don't do that. <laughs> Shift them. Actually, wait, no, 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 hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I can get her to move over here. Wait, why did she. Oh, sedative cockles. Why do I keep thinking of sedative cockles the next to her attack? I don't know why. I get her to move over here because there's a big guy coming through that door and I really don't want to fight him. So use her girl grenade to. I don't know, shift them, I guess. Yeah, that's fine. Thank you, false prophet. Not false, but <laughs> whatever. So she comes over here, seals this door. He comes over here, seals this door. Ha <laughs> ha uh, two hostiles in one turn to defenestrate. I don't think I'm going to be able to achieve that right now. But that's fine. And I think I can end my turn. And then... 11. <laughs> I like how it says defenestrate verb one throw out of window just to just to tell me you know like do you know what the finish straight means like you didn't you don't seem to be doing it there we go okay get your ass out of here you know what actually i can probably because there's nothing telling me i have to like do this in turn two or by turn three so i can just do this grab this intel right actually no wait rewind Come over here. 
grab this intel, take cover. Well, it's probably leave cover. Eh, it's fine. We'll see action. And then see where this the guy that's coming out where the guy that's coming out this door goes next is gonna be. Oh. Okay. So he has mana for time boost. Okay, you know what? <laughs> Move all of them over here, right? Because then I need them to shift. He's still over there. That's good. And okay, can I now do this? This is so unnecessary. What if I do another one? Does this shift forward? Come on, please. Take cover. Take cover. And turn. Do you shift? God dang it. None of you want to shift? Okay. <laughs> See, I'm not too worried because I could just use Spectral Skull to like take these three out. <laughs> no, actually. Nah. Let's move her over here, I guess. Spectral skull. There you go. Yo, none of you want to stand next to a wind? Actually, wait. You know what? No. <laughs> You're going to stand next to a window if you want. I'm telling you. Uh, so... Go to her, take cover. Are you? What's happening? I'm clicking. It's not working. Take cover. What's what, what's happening? Okay, there we go. And you come over here and take cover. You come over here and take cover yeah and then and turn do your move you just refuse to move you know what oh freak i forgot my bad <laughs> my bad everybody keep taking cover see if they're gonna shift this is ridiculous They're just not gonna move. That's crazy. That's crazy. Okay, well, you know what? It's fine. I can't believe I wasted all that effort just for them to not move. This is so stupid. Get us out of here. Anyways. Uh, now she can come over. Where's the best angle for this? Here, I guess. Chain bolts. Uh, what the frick? I guess that's not the best angle. Probably over here. Chain bolts, but. Uh, but, but, mm hmm. Oh, actually, hold on. Okay, okay, I can get this done. I can get this done. I just saw it. I just saw it. I should have done this ages ago. No, but, 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 yep, you can do that. And then he comes over here. Shift him backwards and then he also gives her time boost and this is so uh, this was so unnecessary but i got it done <laughs> oh my gosh chill ass out of here anyways 
Uh, I guess you take cover, you take cover. Oh, frick, they're gonna kill her ass. Um, she has, has she, she has used a, um, how do I, mm. that's fine, you know, you take cover, you leave cover, and then you two can share damage, that's fine, that's fine, die, die, <laughs> <laughs> Radical plan and prevent 10 enforcements in one level. Okay, I thought it was gonna give. I thought it was gonna give me an achievement for having every single one of my team members take damage. 